uh, whether it's <laughs> New Mexico or <laughs> Tarleton or, you know, I mean, it's going to be hard, but, you know, when we go to Sam Houston next year, we're, we're going to try to win that game. There he is, the Aggies' new men's basketball coach ready to get to work. Head coach Jason Houdin making his introductory press conference today along with the school's chancellor and athletic director as they both work to bring stability back to the program. Good afternoon and thank you for joining us for ABC 7 at 5 weekend. I'm Rosemary Montañez. And I'm Sam Harris-Simowitz. Good afternoon, everyone. Well, a new regime is taking over New Mexico State's men's basketball program. The university introducing coach Jason Houdin to the public today after a year filled with controversy and turmoil inside the program. And we have ABC 7 sports reporter Rachel Phillips live from Las Cruces to fill us in on how coach Houdin will try to take the Aggies to new heights with our New Mexico mobile newsroom. Rachel. Sam and Rosemary, let me just tell you that the Pan American Center was a hoot in today as Jason Hooten was introduced as the 28th head coach of this men's basketball program here at NMSU. You can even see that the Jumbotron still has his introductory banner right there welcoming him in. He told us today that this job to him is really like a power five job and he said he knows he's been brought in to rebuild this program with its culture and he said look it's going to be a challenge considering everything that happened off the court last season but it's one he's up for and one he actually thinks he's the guy for. My pleasure to introduce the 28th head coach for our New Mexico State Aggies, Coach Jason Hooten. And he's not the only one who thinks that. There was a real sense of excitement and eagerness from the over 400 people in attendance. Everyone ready to meet the guy that will lead this program to a new chapter and new trajectory. Just take a look at this video. You can tell Mocha is also happy with the pick. Mocha told us today the main attribute he was looking for was a coach that would build a program based on integrity and character, both on and off the court. Hooten is a finalist for the Skip Prosser Man of the Year Award. Guys he played college basketball games with were here and executive director of the Sun Bowl, Bernie Olivas, also in attendance. Mocha also said everybody he talked to about Hooten mentioned his character. And guys, that kind of just shows how well-liked Hooten is. I asked him how he goes about changing the culture here after a tumultuous season off the court, which saw two separate investigations. They made a statement when they hired a guy like me. And I mean that from a, you know, guy that does things the right way, a guy that takes hard-nosed kids, Maybe we over a little, maybe we overachieve a little bit at times, um, you know, and I think you do that because you establish a culture. A, what's your culture going to be? You know, our culture is going to be that we're going to be tough. We're going to play hard all the time. And guys, Hooten said that really the big reason for why he took this job is because of the Aggie fan base. He said he just wants to coach at a school that is a basketball school. And he said this school is exactly that. I have a copy of his contract here. We'll talk about those details later coming up in sports and also have our one-on-one -on -one chat with Hooten. But for now, guys, back to you. 